As the pandemic continues to take its toll on Colorado and federal stimulus checks are a distant memory, the governor and the Colorado General Assembly are taking emergency action. Colorado families and uh, businesses are really, really hurting. So um, we're going to do the best we can. A special three day session will come to order at the Capitol Monday, where eight bills and nearly three hundred million dollars are at stake. Is this money we have in the bank or is this money we're borrowing from the, the budget to come? While Democrats announced the bills have bipartisan support, big negotiations are ahead at the Capitol and both parties have three days to get it done. The the first one is the probably the one that's gotten the most attention so far, which is the um, small business direct uh, financial um, aid. On the agenda, $57 million to help small businesses, 50 million or so dollars towards emergency housing assistance. Third on the agenda is a bill to increase broadband access. This is going to allocate $20 million towards um, broadband capacity uh, so students and teachers can uh, work and learn uh, remotely in the couple of months ahead. Five million to low income utility assistance, 45 million to child care support, three million dollars to food pantry assistance, plus a sales tax relief bill for restaurants, bars and food trucks. Usually they collect it and then uh, send it back to the state. So to, to allow them to, to hold on to those funds um, for the months of November through February. A final $100 million is up for debate to help with the state's COVID-19 health response. What it comes down to in this special session really is what do we have money to do? It all begins Monday. I'm Lori Lizarraga for Nine News. And the Democratic Speaker of the House told us today the sales and income tax revenue was much higher than the state had budgeted. They say that's where the millions of relief dollars will most likely be coming from. Now, if you want a detailed list of the eight bills that state lawmakers will take up in the special session, you can go to the Nine News app. There's a story there as well as on the Nine News website explaining what each of these bills would do, each of them with bipartisan sponsorship.